I'm making this look super hard. This isn't that bad. I should be able to get all the way to DS1 most runs these days. I've gotten a lot more consistent. Last night I was getting a DS1 like every other run, like... I haven't even gotten through Iggy's yet. If I hadn't lost P-Speed on that first run, I might have been a 59, maybe. As long as I don't lose my shell, I can do DS1 every time. And not losing your shell is not that bad. Just gotta... Fucking... Fuck. I get through Iggy. Really? Ah, oh, an 80. I suck. Nice. Alright, I can work with that one, I think. Nice. Yeah, that's fine. <laughs> I really hope Area 51 is talking about Vile. I really want Aaron to be talking about Vile. <laughs> I would laugh so hard if you were talking about Vile right now. This is a really interesting stage. This is the stage that most people who haven't given this run any thought don't understand how to get through. And the magic to gain through here is definitely 
magic. Two pro, five me. Ready to see the world's worst zips? I don't even understand how I messed that up. <sighs> My zips are usually pretty bad, but they're never that bad. Like, I don't understand how I fucking keep catching my feet on blocks. Like, I swear to God, I will never understand how to zip. For the rest of my life, I will never understand how to zip. I can't be taught. I cannot be taught. Good RNG. Dude, I ran any percent for four months of my life, and I never got good at zips. I don't want to hear that shit. Dude, are you fucking with me right now? This run's dead already. I'm not gonna beat my PB, but I'll play through. I don't even have a Fire Flower anymore to do the item switch. Which is fine, I probably would've just fucked it up anyway. Actually, uh, Baby Yoshi can kill this run there. If, uh, if the Lakitu throws a spiny early, um, if baby Yoshi eats it, it counts as a coin. Wow. Sick. So sick.
in this category it's actually faster to do door 5 because if you can take a fire flower in there you can damage boost through it. That is a PB. Okay, that's a PB. I was comparing to my uh, best segment. So, PB. Collapse. I'll keep going. I got I've got more time to be saved, mostly by not being shitty at Star World One. Yeah, uh, I actually lost a pretty passable run last night. Um, the run itself didn't pan out, but it was on pace for a really good time, um, and I lost it because. Um, Yoshi ate a uh, spiny in Star World 3. Thanks, Yuji. Aaron, yeah, technically. I really don't think I'm going to be very happy with this run until I get below 11.10, and I think, I think Link could probably get below 11, but not by much. Um, I think about 10.55 is, is the cutoff, so... Yeah, I gotta get the damage boost in the spike room, which saves about two seconds. And I need to get um I need to get good zips in Star World One. With those combined I might be able to get pretty close to eleven. It's just so hard to get a run off the ground, you know? Dude, it's not even two o'clock, or it's not even three o'clock, and PB Tracker is already down for the day. 
Fugu Manon. Buku Buku. Torpedo. Guska. Spook. Low percent no Star World. Well, you're already talking about being slow just because of having to uh, sit through Roy's. But let's see, what other stuff? Um. You know, the hell of a time making uh, Force of Illusion too fast. Um. It's basically no cape, no Star World, but you don't have a Fire Flower either, which is no big deal. I mean, the Fire Flower is really only ever seriously used for, um, for, uh, bosses. Is there any stage that really needs a Yoshi of any sort? Nothing comes to mind. Beat it without dying or any of certain my lives. I don't know, maybe.